I heard a story the other day about two sisters, I'll call Deb and Diane. Now you know how little offences can build up over time? A silly comment here, a letdown there? Well, for some reason, Diane broke off contact. And Deb tried everything she could think of to restore the relationship. She apologised, she sent gifts, she offered to talk things through, but Diane would not respond. Deb was left feeling sad and also feeling guilty for losing this relationship. My heart went out to Deb. I mean, how many families are fractured through hurts and through grudges? Maybe you're facing something like that even now. In Romans 12, the Apostle Paul gives some really good advice for situations like this. He sets it up by saying not to be proud. I mean, you think about it, how many conflicts escalate because we won't admit we're wrong. He then says not to take revenge. How many relationships are destroyed by returning insult for insult? Then he says, get this, if it is possible, as far as it depends on you, live at peace with everyone. Now this is liberating. We're not responsible for other people's actions, only our own. So do what you can to reconcile, then leave it to them to respond. If you're facing family tension right now, do what Deb did. Apologize for your part in the conflict. Do whatever you can to reconcile, but then rest. You've held out the olive branch. It's now up to the other person to take it.